you know you're in your 40s when you go on holiday and the first thing you do is unpack your bags. Yeah. True story. I just went to visit my mother and within the first hour of getting there, I'd gone into my room, unpacked my bag, hung up my clothes in the closet, put my other clothes in the drawer and then neatly stashed my empty bag in the corner. I mean, it feels like just yesterday, I was in my 20s or 30s and I would have just gone into the room, dumped my bag and got the hell out of there. I mean, who spends time in their room getting settled? Old people, right? That's what I thought. But you want to know a secret? Oh, it was actually quite satisfying. Yes, I have to whisper it because I'm a little bit embarrassed to say that it was satisfying that by day three, the clothes weren't everywhere, that things were still neat and, and ordered and in place. All oh, those adjectives, I'm hearing them now. I mean, neat, ordered and in place. Who am I? What have I become? What's next? Ironing? Anyway, so I started to think, maybe there's a metaphor here, okay? And probably an obvious one. Unpacking, baggage, hmm, doesn't that sound like a metaphor for your 40s? Maybe in your 20s and 30s, you just used to dump your baggage on everyone, okay? And not even claim the bag, it was like, bag over there, oh, I don't know, not mine, what, who? Now, you not only say, this is my bag and this is my space, I'm going to unpack my issues, man. I'm unpacking my issues and I'm owning it and I'm compartmentalizing it. I'm putting it away. So maybe I'm not dealing with it. Maybe I'm just putting it in a cupboard and hanging it in a closet. But at least I'm unpacking my bag, right? So maybe, just maybe, there is some benefit to owning your baggage, unpacking your issues. I don't know. Complete rubbish? What do you think? Use it? Lose it? You choose it.